Hi family, it's Christy with Design Spark Diva and in today's video, I am participating in the Fall Purge. I'm once again excited about this collaboration because every season I get to go through items and determine what is going to stay and what is going to go. So if you watched the last collaboration, hosted by Diva Designing on a Dime, then you will know that this, the purpose of this collab is to get rid of items that no longer serve you or a purpose in your home. And so in the last collaboration, which was the end of summer, I purged clothes, makeup, um, just some personal items of myself, and I was able to donate those to Goodwill. So in this video, I had a bunch of um, wall art that was just sitting in a corner and I said, okay, for fall, I'll go through all of these items and this will be my items for the purge. So I've decided to donate these items um, and if there are any family that decide that they want them or friends in the area or anyone in the area of Atlanta, Georgia, I will give them to you. Um, but if nothing else, I am going to today's Wednesday. So Friday, I'll probably ride over to Goodwill or tomorrow, Thursday, because it's next to my gym and I go on Thursdays and I'll leave these at the Goodwill. So if you're interested in seeing what I'm purging, Keep watching. So these first items that I'm gonna purge actually um, are kitchen decor. They're glass jars. They have a really unique shape and they have these designs and they fit into these little holders. It's like a black antique looking item. I think that these are really cute. They actually were in the home that we purchased, so they were a gift to us from the manufacturer home dealer. However, I just don't have any space for them. Um, I can't think of what I would do with them. They're kind of me, but they're really like, I don't know what to do with them. So if I'm not gonna use them, I can donate them to somebody that will. So there are three of them. And again, they're super cute. I love the shape of the glass. I think they're amazing to look at. However, they're not serving a purpose for me. So these are the first items. As I stated, there are three of them and they will be donated to Goodwill or a friend or family member that wants them. So here's the next items that I'm going to be donating. These are actually flower vases um, or just vases to decorate with. I think they're super cute. They are a marble look. Um, they're not actual marble, but they have a marble look. The holes are really small. Um, for me, I would have liked for them to be open. These also were items that came with the home, as you can see the sizes. Um, I think that they're a good size. I think that someone can do something with them, however, they're not serving a purpose for me. It really, this marble look is not something that I'm using in my home. And I really wish they, this, the mouth of them, if that, if it was, that it was open. So since I'm not gonna use them, I'm going to donate them to someone who will. So these are the next items, three, these three bases. I have this black soap pump. Um, it also came in the house. I think it's, um, there's nothing wrong with it. The spout works, everything works great. I don't use black in my home. Um, if I do, it wouldn't be in my bathroom as a soap dish. Somebody could use it, so I'm gonna donate that as well. The next item that I'm purging is this wall shelf unit. Um, I bought it at a garage sale or a yard sale. A few months ago, I really thought I was going to uh, DIY it. I was going to paint it a lighter color and kind of distress it. 
and I'm just going to use it. I realized that it's too heavy for my wall. I also realized that I could not separate it and use it separately, which is what I wanted to do. It has to be together. I kind of thought about putting some work into it, but I'm not really going to use it. I would have liked to use these two cubes and these two cubes um, in separate spaces on the same wall, but separately. But it's not really going with what I decided to do. And there are some others that I saw that I prefer. So if I do decide to use this again, I'll probably purchase those. So this will be donated as well. The next item I'm donating is this wall art. It says, how great thou art. Um, it's brand new. There's nothing wrong with it. It came in the house. Um, it's just not something that I would use in my home. Let someone else use it that wants to use it in their decor. So this is a great size, a great picture, uh, a great piece of wall art. Somebody would absolutely love it. I think it'll sell fast at Goodwill. So I'm gonna go ahead and purge. So this laugh, live, love picture actually is in four pieces. This one. This one and this one, I got it at, at home on clearance. It was probably, oh, here's the price. It was $19.99 for the set of four and then it was like 70% off. So I got it for little or nothing. Um, and it was super cute in that room, but it's not going with the aesthetics of this house. So I am going to donate it. Next three were also in my she shack again it was just a girly room it had no color scheme it had bright pretty colors most of them had a message that made me feel empowered or made me feel loved when i was in there working and so um but it's not going with what i'm doing now so this first picture was also at home it was 6.99 70% off, so I paid like a dollar for it. Said girls rule. This cute flower picture, $6.99, 70% off at the at home store. It was a Christmas or after Christmas or after Thanksgiving sale. This was also $6.99, 70% off, and it says shoes, champagne, and sunshine. So the three of these pieces of wall art will also be donated to put in my closet. They said dream and believe. The pink with the animal print at the top. They were really cute with candlelight bouncing off of them. Uh, it says Garden Bridge, but I got I think I got these from at home $9.99 and 70% off. I think I got all of these at home pictures in the same day and I was just finding something. I was like, oh, that's cute. That speaks to me. Yeah, dream, believe. That'll make me feel empowered. So I was buying all this stuff and it doesn't really go together and it's not in my color wheel and it was just the phase that I went through at that time so since I'm not going to use it I'm going to give it to somebody else and this last picture says dream for the day hope for the future believe in tomorrow it was also in my office and I'm going to be purging that as well that is it for the purge you guys not as much stuff as the last time but every opportunity to do the purge collab is an opportunity to go through a closet, a corner, um, a dresser, a, a shoe box, and get rid of stuff that's not serving me a purpose. So I'm grateful to you, Kim Diva Designing on a Dime with Kimberly Davis, because you always encourage me and inspire me to do something in my home. So thank you so much. I am going to put the playlist um, down in the description box. Make sure you go visit Diva Designing on a Dime with Kimberly Davis to watch her video as well as all of the participants. Now I'm uploading this late because I just got in from Chicago, but I hope you enjoy and that you're able to find some encouragement to purge as well. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.